What's up my beautiful people? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today's video is going to be a part one of four. Uh, it's going to be like a little series I have on this channel because I purchased this palette which is the Fade Into Hue palette by Colourpop and when I tell you guys that I am like literally overwhelmed by the color choices in this palette, I mean I'm like overwhelmed. Like That's a lot of colors. So uh, I turned to my sister and my three best friends to pick four colors and I'm going to create a look with those four colors. So today's video is going to be my sister's choice and then I have my chummy. She picked four colors and then my other two best friends, Court and Jax, and their choices are going to be, you know. I'm not going to do it like every week, maybe every other week, I don't know, we'll see what we have planned for the next upcoming weeks, but that's what we're doing, so let's get into it. Okay, so I'm going to put up the palette here as well as the colors that my sister has chosen, and those are the four colors that I had to work with for today's look, and I'm kind of excited. Um, also, a little, dis a little, um, I have to share secret with you guys. I have already done this video before, but when I went to go edit it, realized that my mic wasn't plugged in, which means I had zero audio. So that's great. But I am going to switch it up a little bit with today's look, uh, using the same colors, but I'm going to switch it up. So yeah, let's get into it. I'm going to start off with Treasure. Use that as my transition shape. Now we're going to go in with Shine Bright. We're going to put that on the inner corner as well as on the inner corner of the lid and mid lid. Now going in with Love and Warhol, we're going to put that into the outer corner and into the crease. Now going in with bonus points, we're just going to throw that under our lower lash line. Now I'm just going to use a black eyeshadow to create a liner. I don't want to do a liquid liner only because I feel like it's going to be way too dramatic. And I kind of want to keep the look on the colors instead of the liner, so we're going to stick with the eyeshadow. going to apply lashes and I'll be right back. There you guys have it, the final look. I really, um, I'm digging it, you know, I'm digging it. I feel like it, like the colors like complement one another, so I think it looks really good. It's not like really obscure color combination, so good job, sissy. I like the colors. Good choice. I might actually recreate this look a couple times because I think it looks really cute. And um, the yellow makes my eyes pop. Anyways, if you guys haven't already, don't be shy. Click subscribe. You can't see it. The 
batteries died, so the lights are dead. But don't be shy, click subscribe. The little red button down below too. Subscribe, push it, do it. Uh, also, make sure you turn on that bell so you get notified each and every single time I make a new post. Give this video a big thumbs up if you guys enjoyed it. In the comments down below, maybe throw out some eyeshadow palettes and then your color combos that you guys might possibly want me to try. I don't know. Maybe. Yeah. Leave that down below. And uh, I'll leave all of my social media links as well as the Blowing a 4.0 podcast down below. Guys, we have an editor starting October. Editor and social media manager which I'm really excited about. So, if you haven't already checked out the Blowing a 4.0 podcast, do it. Do it now, because you don't wanna miss out, especially because October is coming, and I mean Spooptober is coming, and we're really, really excited for Spooptober. We're having special guests, and we're talking about spoopy things. So, check it out, give it a listen, give it a like, and that is it, so, yeah, is it? I think so. <laughs> That's it for today's video. Once again, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!